What is up everyone? We are back for another thrift haul. What's up guys? <laughs> So last thrift haul that I did, I said that I wouldn't be doing one of these again for a while, but I have an addiction. So here we are. I think it's been about six months. So we're in the clear and I cannot wait to show you everything that I've been buying. I have things from Michigan. I have things from Ithaca and I have things from around here in Massachusetts. We're going to go in order of how I bought the things. So first off, I bought this Cape Cod sweatshirt. It's this really cool material and it is super soft, super cozy. I got it from a consignment store down in Connecticut, right near my modeling agency. And it is the coziest thing ever. Like I have so many sweatshirts hanging up, but this is one of my new favorites. And I think it was literally $10. This is another one that I got from the same place. I have to remember the name. I'll put it down below. But it is a full like dress. But I need to get it hemmed so it hits about like here. Maybe to my fingertips. But it's this really cute cheetah print. And I thought that it would... Oh, and it has pockets. Where are they? It has pockets. Um, but I thought that it would be super cute for golf once I get it shortened. Okay, just... I can picture it and it's super comfy. It's by the brand J McLaughlin. Um, I think this one was more expensive because I looked up the brand and it is an expensive brand. So I think that this was originally like $250, $300 and I'm pretty sure I paid like $35, $40 for this but it came brand new with tags. I found this at the Salvation Army in Michigan. It's by Club Monaco. It is super pretty and sparkly. One shoulder, it is like a sweater material. So it is really nice for fall. And then I got these pants. They go all the way to the floor. I have always loved pants like these. Um, these ones are by White House Black Market. Just with these little like pinstripes. I just think it's really pretty. They do need to be shortened. I'm very short. But so this is by Club Monaco, White House Black Market. This was, where's the tag? I think this was this was $6.99 and then these were $8.99. The next item that I got, they are these page pants. They're not jeans. They're like a velvet, a velvet. They are velvet um, and they're brand new with the tag on them. These were $12.99 and again, brand new. They're super comfy. I wasn't sure if they were too short on me, but they actually hit right below my ankle. So with heels and everything, they'll be super nice. They're wicked cozy and page pants for $12.99. That's a little insane. So super excited that I found these and we have another pair of black pants coming up. Okay, I'm changing up the angle because you couldn't even see the full pants. I got these black, they're just black denim express and they're actually like jegging material. They're super stretchy and these are gonna be really great for castings that I go on for work. So I'm really excited that I found a nice pair of black jeans that especially like hug right here. That's always an issue for me. Also, I found some items that I'm not gonna try on. Well, for these ones, they're really cool. They are leather pants and they have the zipper and they are, oh, you can you see it? They're pink and orange, my two favorite colors. And they have the stripe on the back. They are genuine leather, but they're too small for me. So my friend Olivia is gonna try them on and see if they fit her. And if not, we're gonna pass them on to other people. I also, I really don't wanna try this one on, so I'm just going to show it to you. It's this very cool, it has all these details, which I didn't realize that it was a men's until after I bought it, but it's a men's, but I don't really care. It looks like, um, you know, those cool like workout sets. It's a nice long sleeve. And then it came with pants it says size small medium man which i wasn't looking for in the store but it's by the brand aim high and it's the elevation edition so very cute little workout set especially for doing 75 hard right now and oh i also got a beach cover up it is a cute little nice deep v it's long sleeves and the only reason that I really bought it, why I convinced myself to get it, is because it has pockets. So, I literally said, if it has pockets, I'm gonna get it. And it has pockets. 
Next, we have shoes, and the shoes were the absolute last thing that I looked at when I was at the Salvation Army in Michigan, but I got so lucky, so I cannot wait to show you these. I got these wicked cute pair of Steve Maddens. These were, let's see what the price was. These were $10, and you can tell that they were barely worn, if honestly ever. And then the next pair that I got were these amazing boots. I'm so obsessed with them. They have this sparkly tie. They're by the brand Baby Fat. Everybody knows Baby Fat. Throwback to the 90s, 2000s. These have never been worn. Look at that. And these were $11. Oh my gosh. And look at it. It has the, the cat on the back. I just think these are so cute for fall and winter. They're definitely going to be waterproof. So these are the next shoes that I bought. Look at that. They're absolutely incredible. I think they're going to be super cute for vacation and honestly just like good transition into fall. These were, how much were these ones? These were 99 cents. And for this wicked cool heel, I think that's amazing. The next pair I got were these very cool. They're by J. Renee. And they are this beautiful silver blue color. And I just think that they are so stunning, this little heel. They kind of don't look that pretty, like, alone. But let me put them on and then I'll show you again. So here they are on. I think that they remind me of, like, Manolos. I think that they are just super cute with a pair of jeans. I love a pointed toe. It's funny because when I was younger, I used to hate a pointed toe. But now I love them, and I think that they are just super pretty. And the sparkles add a little something if you have like a plain outfit, and you can just add a little sparkle on your shoe. Moving on to my favorite consignment store is Covet. And this is a shirt from them. It says Boys Lie. I think this was like $15. I don't think it's the actual Boys Lie brand, but I actually liked it for a simple little look for if I want to go like an all black and then I could honestly do heels with this to kind of dress it up but I don't have a simple black t-shirt like I only have white ones so I really liked it okay next this is also from Covet if you follow me on Instagram I already posted in this I brought it to vacation up in Michigan and it is this amazing sweater material it's not too thin not too thick and I think it's just the perfect color Z color combo and it's definitely wicked cozy, obviously super stretchy. And I'm pretty sure this was $25 total. Next, there is this beautiful blouse. We're starting on, this is all from Savers. And where was I? In Saugus. I'm trying it on with my shorts. But it has this beautiful like beaded detail right here. And I think it's going to be a super nice piece for fall. It does give a little bit pajama vibes, but I honestly really like it. And honestly, guys, I'm getting a little hot, so I might just be holding up things um, because changing. And I have my AC off right now because it would be super loud if I had it on. So I might just hold things up from now on. Okay, so the next things that I have, I'm going to be holding up, like I said. But this is actually a couple different trips to Savers. So again, I have a problem. I'm aware. So this is the first one. I don't know if you can see the details. There we go. I think it's really cool. It comes with this belt. I may use the belt. I may not. It's by BB. And this was $8.99. So I'm very excited. And everything, I've tried everything on. So it fits very well. The next thing that's kind of similar is, I'm actually going to probably put this on to show you guys. Because this one's a little confusing. Dirty, dirty. So, I all this frilly stuff comes out, it's buttoned, and I would take it out, but for going out, it's like a vest, and I think it's really cute. It does cover your boobs, by the way. So, if you're trying to be a little scandy, you know, you're trying to show something off, definitely wearing this. It's sparkly. And this was $6.49. Then I got this, they cut out the tag, but this is either by BB or it's by Express. I don't know if I figured out who it's by, but it is dry clean only. And um, 
I have no idea who it's by. But I was looking for a white dress and I just stumbled across this. They had so many dresses and this was literally the first thing that I saw. But it's this like bandage dress that everybody used to wear. I need to work on that stain. The straps and it is the most beautiful looking dress on. So I'm very excited to wear that. Still need to find an occasion. I don't think Boston deserves to see that. Like I feel like I would waste an outfit if I wore that in Boston. Next, I have this romper. It's very cute on and it is by Silence and Noise. I think that's like a TJ Maxx brand, but it's this oatmeal-y color marled and it is so, so soft. This is gonna be very cute for fall with some little either like sneakers, booties, all the jewels, nice long sleeve. They're also like that raglan sleeve, so nice. Not too tight on your armpits. And this was $8.50. So I cannot get over how soft this is either. And then yesterday I went there. Funny story, yesterday I went there and I, you know, right now with savers, they're letting you buy things and then you can bring them back and exchange them because you're not allowed to try things on in the store. So I come home, I had my receipt on the counter, we were eating dinner, I pushed it to the side because I didn't want it to get dirty. Then I told my mom that I needed the receipt and I'm like, mom, it's not here, it's not on the counter, where is it? She goes, well, I didn't throw it out. Look in the trash and it was in the trash. I didn't throw it out and it was all crumpled, all like cr crinkled, crumpled up. Um, and I don't do that. I don't cr crinkled, crumple things up. So yeah, that's not all. So when I find it and I put it on the counter, I put it on like a different counter in the house and I guess the air conditioning was on and it blew it on the floor and I didn't hear Fen for a while. He chewed up my receipt. So luckily he left the big pieces that I needed, which store I was at, what time it was, what date it was and my total. So we're all good. But anyway, this is the stuff from yesterday. So this is by Lulu's. I wasn't sure if this was gonna fit me. I'm actually gonna be wearing this in a photo shoot coming up. Actually, it's tomorrow. Um, but it's a really cute V. And I think it's just so stunning. This lace is so pretty. So I'm very excited to wear it. It is a little tight, so if anybody is tiny and wants this after me, let me know. Oh, also, this dress was $10. The next dress I bought is by Theory and it's a zero and I have really outgrown my days of being a size zero. I'm not a size zero anymore, but this is such good quality. Theory is such a good name and I thought it was super cute. It has a zipper all the way down. It's navy blue. Oh, what's on it? Eh, something's on it, but I love this detailing and has shoulder pads and then you can zip it down to show a little something something if you have anything like I don't but I think it's super cute it's a nice thick cotton material so it's going to be really nice for fall and this was $11.49 then one of my favorites this is a loft sweater I think it's the most beautiful color it's like this oatmeal color this was $8.50 and it has these pockets, it has a strap, it's super cute on. I think it's gonna be super cute for fall. And I'm pretty sure that that wraps up savers. And then we have Ithaca Thrifty Shopper and one thing from Salvation Army and then we're done. The first thing that I got from the Salvation Army and Ithaca, well not the only thing that I got from there, is this purple zip up but it has a double zipper so you can make it really cute and like meet in the middle and then it's like slit here and like slit here. And I had one of these in Ithaca that I got from Thrifty Shopper where we're gonna talk about next, but I don't know what I did with it. It's in a bin somewhere or I might've accidentally given it away, but it was my favorite. So I've been looking for one like it and I finally found one. And this one's by Eddie Bauer. Now moving on to Thrifty Shopper. Is this everything? I think I'm missing a dress. I am missing a dress. So first I got this jacket. I think it is super cute, really nice for my walks with Finn, some workouts in the fall. And it is by Brooks. It is like brand new, 
It's super cute, super chic, and it has that thing, has that bag inside, so you can roll it up. Exciting, I love those. And then I got this very cute blouse. I thought it'd be very nice for fall. Again, it, this is by Chico's. Oh, that was $8.99, by the way, the Brooks jacket. Um, and then I got this really cute blouse. It's kind, it's not like, you know, uniform stripes. It's kind of all over the place. And I really like that. It's all over the place. This is by Chico's. And I did take the tag off this because I almost wore this in Ithaca. But I want to say this was only $4.99. So very cute. And then another thing that I loved was this. This is by BCBG. And it goes like this. And it hugs perfectly, like right here, it hugs perfectly and it just like accentuates everything. My last but not least, one of my favorite brands, this is by eh, Alice and Olivia. Absolute favorite brand, saw this. This was $5, $5. So this, it looks plain and normal, right? These are see-through. And then look at the sleeves. How insane is that? They're very heavy. But, and then they have these like clasps, so you can clasp it all together. I am absolutely in love with this. I have this dress that I also got from Thrifty Shopper. This is also by BCBG, I believe. Um, dee -dee -dee. Yep, BCBG. It is an extra, extra small, and I was like, no way it's gonna fit. But it does fit, and it's this beautiful blue really tight little dress this is the back of it i also almost forgot to mention these ones that i got from thrifty shopper in ithaca the only thing is that the heel needs to be fixed so i'm going to take them to a place to get fixed because i'm pretty sure that these were only oh hi fan these oh thank you fan um these were only like three or four dollars so i really don't mind getting them fixed and they've also barely ever been worn i think they are super cute and I love the little sparkly detail. And that is everything. So thank you for watching. Knowing me, I will probably see you again before another six months because I have a problem. But it's amazing. I get to show you guys everything that I find. And I love doing that. Leave a comment down below about what you want to see. And subscribe if you haven't already. And have a great rest of your week. Bye, guys.